Are you eager to plunge into the submerged mysteries of the ocean and unearth the coveted tridents held by the menacing drowned? Look no further, for this tutorial will be your guiding light to build a remarkable drowned and trident farm in Minecraft Bedrock. All of the materials will be in the description down below. First of all explore your Minecraft world to find a suitable location in Ocean Biome. Look for a relatively large and open area underwater, as this will increase the chances of drowned spawning. Build this farm at Y level 150. So you have to build up 87 blocks from the water level. Make a small 4x4 platform and place your double chest with a hopper pointing to the chest. Then put a rail on top of the hopper. And place a minecart with hopper on top. Create a simple killing chamber where the drowned or other mobs will be drawn into. This chamber should be large enough to accommodate the mobs, but small enough to prevent them from escaping. Make sure there is a 2x2 space right in the middle. On one side of the killing chamber, place a row of pistons facing into the chamber. Beside these pistons place a redstone torch with an observer facing to the piston. Don't forget to put ladder, so you can access the farm easily. To start the trident killer, put a lever on the piston. And don't forget to throw your trident into the chamber. After you've done with the collection system, build up 20 blocks high in total from the trident killer. Add one block on each corners and build out seven blocks in each directions. Fill the gaps with building blocks and you should have a 18 by 18 platform. After that build a 2 blocks high wall around the platform. Extend the platform by placing 7 more blocks in each directions and fill in the gaps. Build a wall around the second platform, and add three blocks on each corners. After that put leaves on top of the wall, so the mobs can't spawn on top of it. Now we're gonna place the water. Start by placing the water on each corners on the second block. After that place the water on the side start from here. Repeat the process on the first platform, if you're doing correctly the mobs should spawn already. And this is the final step, but this is just an optional, you can make a roof so the farm will work day and night. But if you don't have any resources you can skip this part, but your farm will only work during the night time. If you want to make the roof, build up 27 blocks from the first platform. After that build out 18 blocks in each directions, and you should have a 36 by 36 platform made from leaves. Near the trident killer, build an AFK spot where you can stand safely while the mobs are killed. The collection system using hoppers to gather the drops from the killed mobs. These hoppers can lead into a storage chest or a system that utilizes a minecart with a hopper for automatic item collection. To increase your chances of obtaining tridents and other valuable drops, you can equip a weapon with the looting enchantment. Always remember to take safety precautions when building and using the trident killer. Avoid standing too close to the lethal trap, and be mindful of any potential risks. Thank you for joining us. If you enjoyed this tutorial, don't forget to like, subscribe, and share it with your fellow. Until next time, happy crafting!